Hello Internet, this is your narrator Pralit from iSpecs and I am here to walk you through the iOS enhancements. Without any delay, let's jump in to see the new upgrades. Before installing Beta 18, make sure you have the backup done on your device. Reason being just to ensure your data is safe and secure. Also Apple recommended. There are simple steps available on the internet to register yourself to get updates prior to official releases. I have already added my device for these updates. First thing, let's go to settings. Click on general and go to software updates. I have both iOS 17.7 and 18 available. Let's go more advanced and select iOS 18. Click on update now. There comes the passcode authentication. I hope you guys are not picking inside. Oops, my bad. You can just pause this clip to go through the updates that Apple have done. Oh my God, seriously, there are too many. Good, we are cool to proceed. Interface looks same though. I know you guys are very excited for control bar. Let's drop it. So they have created multiple pages for home setup, connectivity and music. Wow, interesting. And now we can also resize these icons and wedges. There is a small option called add a control where you can literally add a lot of options and a lot of features guys including shortcuts, translator, utilities and much more. Now you can add face ID authentication for the applications with a long press on icons. It takes three members and it works. And you can also deselect this option the same way. You can resize the icons with the available extensions by doing it in the same way. Now this UPI extension seriously works well, trust me. Next, we also have passwords added, which is a new and amazing feature which will remember all passwords and it also lets you see it again with authentications. Now you can also create a new security group with passwords and if you want to segregate it separately, you can also name them anything. So another amazing feature which involves artificial intelligence and I was really impressed with photos which actually reads photos and segregates into utilities. Amazing right? This one is crazy guys. I'll just show you open note, select draw and write any math. I'll just write it. 5 into 5. Click on solve and it will solve for you. You can also do multiple math on the same page. That's crazy, right? And the all time favorite number recommendation of your phone book. For sure, Apple users will love this feature. 
last but not the least now apple has given the control to change the tint of your home screen applications now long press on the screen select edit select customize and now you can change to dark mode also you can add tints now you can also select different tints for different wallpapers i hope you all like the new beta 18 features follow ispec for more such contents do subscribe don't miss out any updates so please click on the bell icon thanks for watching have a nice day bye bye